Hello. Another vlog. We'll do another vlog. I'm going to Canterbury at the moment, so bottle share at Flox Tap Room. So I've got a couple of new beers on as well. So yeah, pretty cool. It's good that they've opened it up. Well, they haven't opened it up for us. They're open anyway, but they're letting us do it in there. So, uh, which is really good of them. So, yeah, see you in a bit. Busy train by the looks of it. Uh, people going back London or whatever. Oh, yeah. Another glorious day. Just waiting now. Just waiting. Don't come from that way. That's towards Broad Stairs, which is literally about seven or eight minutes on the train. Or if you go on the, the, the faster train, it don't stop at Dumpton Park. So, uh, so yeah, it's actually getting, it's going to be a cold night, it's one of them kind of deals, nice in the day, sea breezes, um, yeah, so it's an old working station this one. I did a vlog at the beginning of 2020 um, when I went to uh, Dover, the winter Whitecliffs beer festival that I have like annually. I went to it, I've done a whole vlog and stuff, but... I never got round to actually sorting it out and putting it onto a vlog, but but yeah, and then the world set on fire with the old pandemic, so I never ended up posting it. So there's been a fair amount happened since then, of course. But yeah, it's quite a. Uh, I do. I might. I don't know. I might sort it out and post it and say, "Oh, this is like." February of 2020 that's when it was so so yeah just waiting for the old trainage now so HS1 for me my lad it's coming right about now Hour and twenty minutes to London from here. Not bad. It's a twelve carriager as well, so I need to get in. And the first eight. I need to get down the busy bit. Between the train and the platform. 
Canterbury, the city of Canterbury. Is it a city? I don't know. So Canterbury for Cathedral and the Archbishop of Canterbury land, Thomas Beckett. So yeah, lots of history. I've done a few kind of live streams here before. Um, it's a bit patchy for reception in some parts of Canterbury for some reason. Uh, but it's quite busy at the moment, so so yeah, try not to get in anyone's way, rushing for trains, etc. So a big, big student town. It's got a couple of colleges, etc. 
Um, there's a new brew dog come in as well. I'm not sure when in the summer. Um, there's a new part, like a up and coming area. I think East Canterbury that they're developing and stuff. So I've got that going on. If you're into that sort of thing, um, guest beers all the way. Um, but yeah. I'll switch the camera around in a minute. I'm also quite wary of recording people. So. So there's a great tap room there. Um, worth visiting. Pegasus tap room, really good. Do some good, good craft beer in there. Well known stuff as well. Um, sometimes get some really quite new releases, things like Verdant. So, so if you're in Canterbury, it's a short, literally two or three minute walk off the train. So it's really good. So. Springtime, the Garden of Eden. Eden? England. What about that? Don't eat the apples. Interesting. Bosch karaoke. Right, I'm gonna go blind and not go straight down the high street which is that way I'm going to go to the right which I think is going to cut quite a bit of time out of my journey so It's going to be a cold night, that's for sure. I'm expect expecting to get tooted at, like you do. So it makes you drop your phone or something. That's all it would be for, of course. But yeah, rush hour and the ring road of Canterbury. So I think I'm going the right way. Uh, We'll find out in a minute. Ashford, A28, that'll do. We're not walking that far, mind. It's on the uh, outskirts of Can southern part of Canterbury. Uh, flock tap room, so... I've been once before. Um, on the opening weekend. God, when was that? remember about three weeks ago I reckon something like that is it early March maybe but yeah it's really good uh, big space uh, yeah so I'm hopeful I've cut off quite a bit of uh, time of my walk here without even looking at a map, so it's bound to be wrong. Because obviously my, f my map is on my phone, so I'll get back to you on that one. It wouldn't be the first time I've been terribly wrong with a map. I went to Bradford once, 
Hey Rob. Uh, nothing looks familiar. Nothing looks familiar. Not familiar. Family. Familiar. Can out well busy. This all over here. Anyway, we'll find out if I got lost in a minute. It was the right way. Makes a change. So that's cut off probably 15 minute walk going around the outskirts of Canterbury Ring Road. So it's probably another 10 minutes from here. So Canterbury East Station just there. Just going over the bridge, under the bridge even. Last time I'd done this walk it was absolutely hammering down. Gale force winds, drenched. So there we go. We'll see you when I get there. Might have a hat on in a minute, you never know. And finally made it wasn't too bad. Literally a 15 minute walk. Nothing like last time. Mind you, I went via a few pubs last time. But this is the space. This is uh, Flox premises, all this. Massive. So, there's the, uh, as you can see, the opening there. Let's just cross over. Run over. Of course, two cars I've seen in the whole estate, and it's when I run across the road. So, there we go, quite bright, just like their cans. Tiny little entrance, but it goes into a big seating area. Music, yeah! <laughs> so, yeah, oh, back down to the well, up to the station. So, just left uh, Pegasus. Really great night. Um, big shout out to everyone who uh, who was with tonight. I ain't even gonna bother saying all the names because I'm gonna forget someone. So. I know most of them, but there's one or two that I probably forget, so not doing it. Um, a really lovely evening. Bottle share and a couple of beers just now in Pegasus. Um, I'd have Verdant's Bloom um, on draft. Oh, it's a lot different from what I remember it, but I think it's more where beer's gone since our last time I had it. Still very nice. But, uh, and a uh, Colonel, one of their pale, was it an IPA? Can't remember. It's one of them. It's, it's lovely to try a new Colonel beer, as always. So the station's just there. But yeah, I think I can get through the side gate now. Looks like there's some pissed up people over here, so we'll find out in a minute. 
I've got to go over that bridge. So I've got about probably about five, six minutes for my train, so anyway, I'm the word really. This guy just taking a piss right on me, so Jesus. really. <laughs> the carnage. Guy taking the piss in the open view. Fucking hell. Look at the state of that down there. So. I can't believe where he's taking a piss. Uh, oh, lovely. Lovely. You're famous. You're famous now, my lad. So, yeah. Take no whistles to see trains off. I'm gonna go this side. There's a few people around, so. But yeah, we'll go this way. And where's the train gonna be? Six coaches. Eight minutes past. We're about five minutes away. Not bad. Five minutes for the old train. The other train's going now. We've missed the piss head. Not you, Rory, but... Fuck off. You've left your mark. Or stain, whatever you want to call it. Ooh, look at this. The quality of beer people drink in Canterbury. So yeah, sorry it's a bit of a... It was a massive long gap between kind of videos earlier on, but gotta look old. You are old. So yeah, just waiting for the old train now. So uh, yeah, we're back back in a second. I shouldn't say that between videos, but it is what it is. Here we go. On the way home, then. Look at that red nose. Alky nose. Um, been a great, great day. Oh, well, evening really, not day, but um, some fantastic people. See, beer for me is always secondary to the company you're in. Always, and it always will be. Sharing the experiences of good beer with good company is always better. You know? it's one of them. Um, that's why, I've, for me, reviewing beer, it's, it's almost like if you get a great beer, it's quite sad, really, because you want to share it and stuff. Um, all that kind of kind of deal. So there's a massive gap between this vlog at the beginning and then it just went straight to the end, unfortunately. Just one of them deals with the music blaring out. But, um, so I'm on the way home now from Canterbury. Um, just... Um, I always get left deflated. I do anyway. It's just like, oh, that was so good. That, and then you go home and it's like, it's never as good, you know? You always thinking, oh, when's the next one? When, when's the next get together with, you know, your group of friends and stuff, whoever you're going out with, you know? It's just, um, it's always a little bit sad. You know what I mean? 
as Pete would say. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's definitely one of Peter's sayings. Do you know what I mean? Without the Harry bit. Well, unless he's with Harry. Um, but yeah, it's just... It's such a good time that you get that anti-climax when you're going home. It's bullshit. I hate it. You want to live with these people. You want to. You want to. You want to get like a five, like a twenty-bedroom house. And all these great people. You want, just you just want to be with them all the time. I do anyway. So. Yeah. It's the pinnacle of things. It's not what you're into. It's the people that you. It's the people that are into it with you. Deep conversation. But yeah. And the amazing thing about all this is the, the walks of life that um, brings people together. Some people on low wage, some people on decent wage. Some people really good wage managers, and then some people are on like fucking nuts wages. And but for that few hours, you're on the same level. You're enjoying it. You're enjoying the company. So it's possible. That's the way I look at shit. It's possible. It breaks down barriers. Just for a look, just for that moment, for a few hours, enjoy the beer company. But you're into the same thing, and it's not just through beer; it's through any kind of interest. I find that I found anyway. Um, it doesn't have to be beer. It could be darts. It can be, you know, a whole load of things. It's a level up, you know. It's wonderful. It's just a shame that the life part gets in the way of that why does it need to be something you're into to associate hang on get too deep now but yeah it's shit I thought about for a long time anyway hope you enjoyed this kind of semi vlog wasn't the full on wasn't the full Craig as some people would say um but yeah, there'll be more people. More people. There'll be more vlogs coming on soon. So coming on strong. So um, you'll take care. See you on the next one.